guys welcome to another one of my videos just got back from the gym and i'm still a little bit out of breath so sorry about that as i was coming back home i had some post by my door and i just wanted to show you this little unboxing because i got a box of stuff and i was like eh, what is this i don't remember ordering who could this be from and um Turns out it was from my friend Percy in China, the eyewear designer, but it's not glasses. We always video chat and I miss you so much, Percy. And I totally forgotten that you said you'd do this. I almost thought you were joking. So I'm gonna open it now. And she sent me like a little box of goodies um because we were talking about some stuff i video chat with my friend percy all the time like every couple of weeks we try and chat on the phone catch up and see how our lives are going and i was sort of telling her how i'm like having wrist problems just from working she got really worried about me which she's such a sweetheart and she was like oh let me send you some like chinese medicine stuff so she sent me some stuff i don't know what any of this is so if you know what this is guys you can comment it below i'm probably just gonna message her and ask her again Ugh, look how great this packaging is i love this so much and then she's also sent me this actually oh my god how cute is this packaging as well look at this how nice is that Thank you so much, Percy. So that's nice. I don't know what these are for. I have to ask it. It's probably for my wrist, maybe for something else that we were talking about. I don't know. It was a few weeks ago now. I'm going to have to double check and ask about how to use this stuff because I can't read the instructions. So thank you, Percy, for always looking out for me. You're so sweet. And also, there's Prada box in here. I literally opened this box and was like, what? I didn't... I can't afford Prada, I didn't buy anything from Prada and I forgot we were having a really funny conversation this is maybe mean to talk about this um, in my vlog but she was like, ages ago she was dating some guy who was really about like gift giving in this very extravagant way and she's just really not like that she was like, this isn't impressing me, can you please stop if, if anything it's making me feel really uncomfortable um, and he did it anyway and bought her another bag and she was just like it's not even my style like you're not actually paying attention to what kind of person i am or like what i like you're just assuming that if you buy something in a big brand that it's going to impress me and we were just kind of like having a little giggle about that sort of stuff and um and she was and i was like oh my god what what are these bags show me and she showed me this one this prada oh my god i can't believe you sent me this <laughs> Percy. So she said that he got her this Prada bag. Anyway, it clips onto here and I cannot do it right now. He bought her this little Prada clutch bag, like wallet bag. And I was like, oh, it's cute. It's, you know, just a Prada bag. And I laughed and I made a joke and I was like, I'll have it. <laughs> and she's like, okay, I'll send it to you. So here it is. She actually sent it to me. <laughs> Thanks, Percy. You're so cute. You sweetheart. I will use this though. So she was like, well, if you'll use it, great. Anyway, this was... This was a really cute surprise, a little like care package for my friend Percy in China. So I thought I'd share that because let's put a really big smile on my face. So cute. Ugh. I miss her. I miss you, Percy. I know I've said that like three times now, but I miss you so much. And since I'm sharing, since I'm sharing, I've also got a really cute little letter from Helen Bucher. Bucha? Bucha? I actually have never said your name out loud, Helen. I'm really sorry. Um, but we're, we're mutuals on, on Instagram. Helen is a really fantastic illustrator. Check out her work here. But I follow Helen on Patreon. So this is my monthly patron from Helen this month. What have you sent me, Helen? I actually have a really bad habit of like following people on Patreon and not really checking out their posts that often. I'm in it for the rewards, not gonna lie. I like getting little care packages in the post. Oh my God. How cute are these? Oh, Helen did some really, so Helen takes some really nice photographs sometimes as well. Um, and it looks like this month she has taken really gorgeous photographs, edited them, and then put cute little illustrations on the front, included her little characters. Isn't that nice? Oh my god, these are really nice, Helen. Thank you so much. Quality is really lovely as well. That's why it's nice to support people on Patreon, guys. We love it. 
as artists. We love it. So yeah, I'm gonna stop flapping about now because I'm starving. I'm gonna make some lunch. But once I have food in my fridge, probably just gonna make a hefty salad. That sounds sad to come back from the gym and eat a salad, but I'm gonna make a really big tasty one. Maybe like chicken Caesar style with some hummus and some beetroot. I haven't really decided what I'm gonna do yet today. It's supposed to rain like all of next week. Today's like the only day that it isn't raining and it's not particularly sunny. It's not that cold. So I might, I might head out today. I might do a little solo day day. Yeah. It's a little late in the day, to be honest, to be going out and heading out now. It's like half three, but it is not raining. It is a bright day. It is not too cold. I didn't go anywhere this weekend, so I would just like to head out. Oh, as I'm talking, the sun is coming out. Probably won't last long. But yeah, I want to head out while there's still some sunshine out for a couple of hours. I've found some film, a roll of film that I did in LA that I just totally forgot about. It's been on the side of my kitchen for ages. So I'm gonna go take that to Aperture in Fitzrovia, which is where I like to get my film developed and my favorite coffee places next door. I've taken a book, might do a little bit of shopping. I've got a really hefty voucher from Liberties that I need to use by the end of the month. So I'm gonna maybe browse in there, just relax for a couple of hours, then I'll probably come back and uh, do some drawing or something. So taking it easy today, actually. Don't know, in that kind of mood this week. No.
is my hat hair. That was nice. Just having a little coffee shopping date with myself today. I really needed to get out. I've been feeling, I don't, you probably noticed in my last couple of vlogs actually that I mentioned that I've been feeling kind of low and my anxiety has been really high for some reason. That was actually quite hard to get out of the house today. Felt like I was rushing around and I had to keep reminding myself that I'm not going anywhere in particular and I'm not meeting anyone so I didn't have to like rush around London like I normally do because I'm always late for stuff so I wasn't late for anyone because it was just me so yeah I had to keep reminding myself to just slow down and enjoy the sights and look around I did a little bit of cheeky shopping today this really has to be the last time I cannot keep doing this yeah I had a really nice hefty liberties voucher because i have a liberties loyalty card which i would honestly recommend if you even shop in liberty just a little bit like a bit of perfume and a bit of makeup like every now and again just sign up for the loyalty card this isn't an ad i'm just saying how great it is because i don't really spend a lot of money in there but i seem to always have a voucher for something um that i can spend on anything in the whole entire place so usually it's only like 20 quid 15 quid or something but yeah in the post the other day i got a voucher for 120 pounds i have no idea what it is that allowed me to get such a great voucher but the, yeah their loyalty points program it's really good like you barely have to spend any money to get some really nice deals so uh that's why i had a little mooch around liberties today i ended up getting more jewelry so for those of you who have, who have watched my previous vi video about all my jewelry collection i am going to add to that today uh, you can't stop me it's uh, it's a curse i swear it's a curse but i got myself well, something something from Sean Lean. Ah, oh, I love Sean Lean. For those of you that don't know, Sean Lean is the jewellery designer that worked, was like best friends and worked with Alexander McQueen back when he was alive. His stuff's great and I pretty much managed to get some earrings basically half price because of my fantastic voucher. So I've had my eye on these for ages. Very cute packaging. Very cute. I don't want to open it, but I am going to. Yeah, I got some earrings. I thought, why not? I've been feeling low. Might as well do some shopping therapy. It's like I'm happy and there's guilt all at the same time, but there we go. Here's my nice earrings. Very happy with this purchase. I'm going to wear these all the time. They are so cute. So you know me, I like a statement piece of jewellery, so... Well, multiple pieces of statement jewellery all at once. Cute, right? Very cool. Love how big they are. Love. That makes me happy, yeah? I like new things. <laughs> Shopping therapy does help. It's nice to get out. And it's been a while since I just like sat in a cafe and read my book. So that was nice. I'm glad that I kind of tried to overcome these weird feelings I get when I want to like hibernate and not go anywhere. And I, it's just, I know that's a really bad habit to sort of get into. I think I might do a little bit of drawing now. It's quite late, it's like eight, but it feels kind of cozy, cozy time to kind of maybe do a little bit of illustration. I want to plan ahead for the next couple months of my patron rewards because I'm going away twice the end of next month and the month after i don't know how I, I i seem to have like booked it really close together without really thinking of the dates too well but um my friend who's getting married her hindu is in paris next in the next couple of weeks and we're going to disneyland i think i mentioned this in my last vlog but i'm really i'm really excited i probably mentioned it in all of my vlogs up until we go and uh and then yeah i come back only for like a couple of days, like three or four days, and then I'm going on holiday with my sister. We're gonna go to Ibiza. No partying, just relaxation. I hope it was kind of like the best timing for her to get time off work. So not a lot of planned away time, which is nice. So I need to kind of get on the work, work time.
so much for watching you guys i really hope you like my little solo date day that i had by myself today if you want to support me here on youtube or just in general please don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel but you can also support me on patreon here for as little as two pounds a month where you get lots of behind the scenes on all my sketches that i do that i don't post anywhere else but patreon um, and just like life updates and stuff and another great way to support me is my website uh, over here which you can buy prints and silk scarves and little accessories and stuff and in the meantime i hope you guys have a really great rest of your week thanks again i'll see you in my next vlog <laughs> bye guys